Hello everyone! I realize I haven't vlogged yet, and so I need a vlog. <laughs> Which is fine. What the heck? Oh, the squirrel! Oh my god, perfect timing. Wait. Oh, I thought he was like laying in sunbathing. Oh my god, BB! Why are you not focusing? There we go. No, oh, don't run away. <laughs> we love you! Come back! Wait, I have an idea. Did he come over here? As you can see, the raccoons did come by. Um, apparently nobody wants cauliflower. <laughs> That's just so sad. But you know what? Like, last time I put cauliflower out, oh my god, the animals loved it. So I don't know what's up with that. But it's okay. I might just have to push all of that down there so it's not just in the grass. <laughs> I'm sure my dad would love that. <laughs> I'll probably do that today. But yeah, so, so far it's been a pretty great day. I officially had my first coaching session with Constantine. It was super awesome. We had a lot of good conversations. I think we're really kindred spirits in the sense of like, I think he's going to be like a really good coach for me. So I'm really excited about what's going to happen. I can update you guys a little bit, but I'm not going to talk like too much about it. But anyways, yeah, so got that all done. That was fun. And now I'm just wrapping up some extra things I wanted to send to him. And I'm probably going to rhinestone today. Hopefully. I don't know. I, I have to, I want to go clean up the mess outside first. So we'll see. With so much excitement in the day, I forgot that today's our trash day. So taking out the trash. Woohoo! All of the things I do. You're just like me. Trash! Ooh, look, sunbeams. Ah, oh, pretty. <laughs> I came out here and I kind of tried to move the cauliflower around a bit, but I'm like, it ended up being harder than I thought it was gonna be, so I decided to leave it here and I'm like, it'll eventually be, be eaten, right? I hope so. <laughs> As you might feel, I don't know if you can see that that distant. I like, <laughs> there's a. I literally took a rake and I felt like I was just like batting them down here, but you could see all the cauliflower everywhere. Yeah, I feel like I was making more of a mess than what was there, so... Okay, nature, do your job, have fun. <laughs> Anyways, I totally forgot that I had to actually grab the containers for the raccoons to wash. I wash these by hand every time I use them. <laughs> I know a lot of people are probably like, uh, you should be careful with that disease. Well, you know what? Raccoons have a really bad stigma. They're not as diseased as everyone thinks they are. I'm not saying it's not possible. <laughs> I'm just saying, like, I'm just, yeah, it's not as bad as everyone thinks. And I'm super careful, like I promise you. I wash them really well, then I wash my hands really well. We're all good. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna do that. That takes two hands, so I can't vlog during it. <laughs> Hello. I decided to walk up to the store because in this area, we're really fortunate about during the pandemic where I live because we have a grocery store that's like literally right in front of our neighborhood that also has a Starbucks. And I just really wanted a Starbucks. <laughs> and I thought it'd be great to come out and sorry, I'm walking up a hill <laughs> and enjoy this like beautiful sunny day because you don't get much of this during this time in the Seattle area. <laughs> Trust me, you do not. I do have my mask, don't worry, I'm safe. But right now there's no people around so I'm just being free and not wearing it and taking in the fresh air but yeah it's really nice because it's like literally there's like a path like a hidden path in my neighborhood that takes me to the store so I'm like that's right getting Starbucks feeling extra motivated today it's really exciting to me I love when I have extra motivation in a day Anyways, I'll show you guys the path when I get there because it's cool and it's all hidden and stuff and I love it. <laughs> yes, it looks like just a normal little road, doesn't it? Just wait. Bam, hidden trail. <laughs> <laughs> 
Yep, it's kind of creepy actually when you think about it, but we're all good here. He goes to the back of the grocery store. I love this trail because it's just so cool to be able to just walk to the store so easily without having to get into your car. I'm masked up and ready to go. This is one of Jesslyn Siwa's masks. It's really big, so I have to twist it to put it over my ears. That's why it looks like that, but it's sparkly. And it says nothing like, <gasps> yay. All right, we are gonna go to the store. We're gonna get some Starbucks and maybe something to eat. Hello, I'm home now. I got myself a green tea, matcha green tea frappuccino with one pump of chai. It's almost gone now. I was talking to my dad for a while, so I was sipping on it. And I got some sushi from the store because I'm hungry. And Mike and I eat really late on Thursdays because he gets home super late from work. So I'm going to eat now and I'm going to try to edit this and hopefully rhinestone. I am obviously back in the workshop here, my dad's workshop. With all, surrounded by all my rhinestone things. I'm very thankful he lets me use this <laughs> for my projects as well. <laughs> all right, well guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I'm gonna end it here because I'm really gonna try to focus on everything. But thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. <laughs>